what's going on dsg it's your boy donald bradley back at y'all another video and today we are over on black griffin's channel uh insane a has been hotel song black griffin and basic um i remember silva hound did a track with black griffin and i was peeping down here in the description did not know that black griffin was the singing voice of alistair in the pilot for has been hotel had no idea you know what i'm saying saying that it, uh, this thing is saying that it had some that he wasn't sure he could do this uh because you know uh the the viv thing and the has been hotel team whatever whatever but they said they liked it so it's here and this came out uh over a year ago or about a year ago yeah yeah over a year ago june 11th yeah june 11th 2021 so uh, we 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 we've been done miss this but you know what i'm saying i was honestly just curious and i was looking up some has been hotel stuff and i seen this and i think that the radio demon is probably my favorite character and once the show starts rolling out more stuff we are he, he, he's probably just going to become more of my favorite character so we're here and we're going to see what's going on be sure to like be sure to subscribe follow me on all that there social media and we ain't here with any further ado. three two one click <laughs> Dearly beloved, for your entertainment, it's my pleasure to introduce to you Hell's latest arrival, the Equal Opportunity Killer, Alistair. W intro. W intro. That 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 intro right there. That was. Mm, <laughs> I loved every bit of that. To you, Hell's latest arrival. Latest equal arrival. Opportunity equal opportunity. <laughs> Hello, it's nice to meet you. Hey, hey. Uh, can you tell me where I am? Say what? I don't know how I got here, but I, I think I'm starting to understand. I don't belong among the angels, and maybe that's just fine with me. The things I did up there were high school, but now I'm going for my degree. Mm, the things I did up there was high school, but now I'm going for my degree. You're talking about the stuff I got sent to hell for. Oh, that was just that was high school stuff. The stuff I'm about to do now that I'm down here. Oh my lord, yo, I'm I'm liking this already. Um, there's the, like this kind of music, like this kind of vibe. I can't like um, uh, like pinpoint it. Uh, the genre. You're gonna let me know, let me know in the comments. But um, I like it uh, definitely uh, within this element as far as Hasbro Hotel is concerned. So yeah, let's get into it. Me. The things I did up there were high school, but now I'm going for my degree. Hey, sorry, but you just got in my way. I promise, honey, I can't feel your pain. I feel like I've heard at least some of this before. Maybe, I don't know. All right, we move. Hey, sorry, but you just got in my way. I promise, honey, I can't feel your pain. And maybe I enjoy it just a little bit. That was sick. I love that with the 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 edit on the the, the visuals too. I enjoy it just a little bit. That makes me insane. Hey. Been the same since I expired. Doesn't mean that I plan to retire. I haven't been the same since I expired. Doesn't mean that I plan to retire. He's like, hey, hey, I just made a move. I just made a move. It ain't it ain't, it ain't nothing finished. <laughs> Let's go. And now I have the power to be all of you in entertaining fire. Yo. This is doing a lot with a little. I love this. The the switch up, uh, uh, the video in the background. Since it's just a picture, like I still consider this doing a lot with a little, keeping still keeping it visually entertaining. I love it. Entertaining. Hey. 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 Weren't you an old pal of mine? Departed from us far too early, but now we're meeting a second time. We used to have such fun together, and maybe you have what I need. But first, I have one tiny question. Tell me, do you demons bleed? Yo, I love the the creepy behind inflections that they got going on with the with the song and the video. You know what I'm saying? And, like, it's. I think it's, like, one of the reasons, like, Callister, the way they portray him in the thing is, like, yeah, he was about that, you know, that that, that K-word <laughs> when he was up there. And now he's down there. He's like, hmm, can I do the same thing to y'all? Like, I know y'all demons. Y'all already, you know what I'm saying? But can we, can I still, yeah? Oh, shit. <laughs> Let's go. Tell me, do you demons bleed? I feel like I've heard this. I'm not sure though. But you just got in my way. I promise, honey, I can feel your pain. And maybe I enjoy it just a little 
like the melody's got me if there's something else like this y'all gotta link me to it i don't know was it was it in the song or something i don't know but i know i've at least heard part of this before i don't think i've reacted to it i don't think so but if I did, that was a, it was a while back, and I, I must have forgotten. I'm sorry if that's the case. But as it sits right now, if I did, I liked it back then because I like it now. So let's go. They're looking like the Ch Cheshire Cat. <laughs> Yo, that was dope. We listened to that dope here. I thoroughly enjoyed that. Um, like I said, that style of music put in a like horror-ish vibe, I think is just an amazing combination of two things right there. Um, vocally, you know what I'm saying? It was it was it was dope. You know, it wasn't like one of those belt out crazy vibrato, you know what I'm saying, things like that. It was nice. You know what I'm saying? The notes was hit, the melodies was moving with the with the instrumentation. And it was definitely catching the vibe that it was trying to put out. You know what I mean? And what I do like about that music versus lyrical content, you know what I'm saying? The the music, the musicality of it is very upbeat. You know what I'm saying? Very upbeat. But lyrically, it's 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 morbid. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But at the at the same time, it's not like morbid in the sense of talking about gore and things like that. It's like it's like implied morbidity. You feel me? It's implied morbidity. Uh, not, not so many lines as direct as, um, do you demons bleed in there, but you just kind of know what's up. You feel me? So this was a piece, man. I loved it. That's the take. Be sure to like, be sure to subscribe, follow me on all that there, social media, and I'll catch y'all next one, man. Peace. <laughs>